Hey. Welcome back to Daytime Ottawa. Back to tell you about a beautiful love story that has turned into a fabulous business. We are joined by the owners of Karma Cashmere. We have David Venn and Prajina Karmacharya. Yes, that's true. I got it. Okay, hey. we're just going to call them Dave and Praj for the yeah. rest of the segment. But welcome to you both. Thank you so much Thank for being you so here. Much for having and, us. and Praj, as I said, this this did come about as a, as a love story. How did you and Dave meet? First of all. <laughs> Well, we both were studying in Netherlands. We were doing a master's degree there. So Dave from, came from Canada, and I came from Nepal, and we met in Netherlands. So we were in a class together, and, you know, we fell in love. And after um, 16 months, we got engaged in Netherlands. So nice. Dave proposed to me on a horse ride, <laughs> like wow. a knight in shining armor. <laughs> nice, Dave, good, man. Like a horse ride, like on the beach kind of thing. Yeah, you got to hold the ring really steady when you do it. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, I just <laughs> Could you? Just... <laughs> That's a wonderful story. Yeah. And then from there, you, you both enjoyed travel and, and yeah. adventure, right? And after that, we both went to Nepal after engagement, and we got married there. Um, and we went to honeymoon on the mountains of Nepal. And that's where we, we discovered the business. It's beautiful. So how, how, did the, how did that come about? You were walking along and saw a cashmere goat and said, <laughs> you know, I, honey, <laughs> you know, I like that goat. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what did you did you find Dave uh, some some different manufacturing we did there's a really rich rich industry it goes back okay. you know uh, hundreds of years in in Nepal and so um, the Kashmir comes from the goats who live in the mountain areas right. of uh, Nepal and the Himalayas over 14,000 feet and it's because of that that they developed this insular fiber this uh, really warm fabric some of the warmest insulation in the world and uh, yeah so that's where the Kashmir produced it's all brought down um, brought in from, from the, the mountains and, yeah. and produced into these beautiful shawls. So these goats are up there um, being groomed carefully by, by people the... brushing them daily and <laughs> giving like them... like a good deal. I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't be against being a goat if that was the case. <laughs> that was the lifestyle? Because they, you don't slaughter them. It's like they don't, just their... Exactly. It's shed their naturally. Wool, right? Yeah, and it's shed naturally as well. Is it really? Yeah, okay. because in winter time the weather gets minus 35, 40 degrees up there in the Himalayas. Right. Um, so in order to keep warm, they develop this inner fiber. And during springtime, when the weather gets warmer, they shed it naturally. So it's really beautiful that there's no harm done to the animals as well. And one of the reasons cashmere is ex one of the expensive fibers is that it's shed. So it's very few that actually you have when you have to weave it. So that's the pure, okay. pure right. cashmere. Now, Praj, you, you met one-on-one -on -one all, all, all the artisans. Is that correct? I did. So I visited the factories and also met with each artisan myself because I wanted to make sure that everybody's working in a good condition. That was very mm -hmm. important to me, like especially me coming from, from that country. Right. Um, and most importantly, they enjoy making these fabrics. Right. So that was really nice when I told them how these cashmere that they produce, which takes 10 to 15 days just to make one shawl. Really? So it's a wow. really meticulous process. So when I told them that how it's treasured in Canada and all, you know around the world, and they were very happy. It's the <laughs> effort and labor that people are treasuring. So they were very, um, very happy about it. Now, these are a blend cashmere silk, a 70-30 blend. So why do you uh, throw the silk in there? Okay. Well, the silk, silk just gives it a nice sheen. There's two two fabrics here, so yeah, blend of cashmere and silk, and then we've got the hundred percent cashmere as well. And it just you know, the, it's a little different texture. Uh, the weight is a little yeah. different. It just gives a little bit of a sheen yeah. on the uh, on the color there. Right. Uh, but certainly both will keep you warm in the Canadian winter, that's for sure. <laughs> well, and this is, I think that's the beauty of it. You've kind of blended the two cultures together mm -hmm. with, you that's know, true. as you said, keeping warm, being a Canadian guy, Dave, you know, you know all about that. And then of course, <laughs> Praj yourself from being from the, from the area, it must give you a great sense of pride too, to bring some of your culture. It here does. To and definitely Canada. it gives me an excuse to talk about my country and <laughs> yeah. culture as well. And since I'm here, it's a perfect blend of two cultures that we both uh, come from. So certainly, yes, I do feel proud. And it's a luxury product and something mm -hmm. that the royalties used to wear. It's not mass produced. And I feel good that it's coming from a good place. Um, so, yeah, yeah, I feel proud about it. Now, that was one of the things I was saying on the break that, uh, I mean, everyone's got those pashminas that you buy for 15 or 20 bucks. Right. You know, I've got, uh, I've got them in a whole range of colors because they're, they're a handy thing for a party. This, however... Um, is, like you said, a luxury product, yeah. a lot more expensive, but the warmth and yes. the quality of it is is phenomenal. Yes. 
What sort of uh, price point are we looking at for these? Um, so we have 100% cashmere, like the one I'm wearing in red. So 100% ca cashmere comes for $149. Okay. And we ship for free all over Canada. And we give wrappers really nicely in these boxes yeah. as oh, well nice. for free. And because it's a holiday season, so if you want a nice card and a nice message to somebody, we do that for free and we'll handwrite your message as well. Um, and the 70% cashmere and silk brand comes for $99. Okay. Now, and you also give back, right? Yes. You, you, you give back uh, some of the proceeds. Uh, yes. Tell us who you give it to. It's a, it's a particular program in Nepal. Yeah, we do. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a charity. So my, my wife and I both have a background in the nonprofit sector. And okay. so building that into the company was important for us. So uh, we do, we give 5% of all profits back to a charity in Nepal that works through a program called Mothers to Mothers. And it helps low-income mothers care for their children, provide education and um uh, other yeah. resources, health resources for them to uh, live a full life. That's nice. fantastic. <laughs> now, well, go ahead. Sorry, Joe. So, what how, what kind of turnaround on the shipping could they could people have? Oh, this, so. this time of year we're we're full on. So, okay. yeah. <laughs> all right, you know, twenty four hours we're turning yeah. it around and awesome. sending those back out there. Yeah, if somebody in Ottawa orders a shawl from us, like we do expedited shipping for free, so they'll get it the next year. And people can purchase online. Are online. you in any stores in the Ottawa area? As well? um, right now, we have very few selection at okay. Bijou Bijou, but most okay. of our collection is um, is online. I so. saw Bijou Bijou on, yes. on Facebook. They yeah. said, "Oh, we only have a couple left." Yeah. Yesterday, when you yeah. mentioned that you were coming on the show, well, thank yeah. you very much thank for joining so us much. today. Thank Congratulations. You so much. Thank the success again. of your business and thank yeah. you Julie hey sorry I couldn't get you one I'll get you next <laughs> you time you look lovely it's fantastic <laughs>